So now let's see how we can work around with advanced text edit animation options. So to do that, first of all, I'm going to bring in a text to access advanced animation options, double click on it and click on advanced. Once I do that, you can see that advanced text edit window opens up and now you can see that there's a text. So I can simply select this around right here uh, by clicking and dragging it and I can type in my own text right here. If I were to hit the play button, you can see that nothing happens right now. So this is the timeline area for the text, which I can decrease right here or increase this out just like that. I can go around and zoom in the timeline and zoom out of the timeline as I would with the regular timeline. So I can go around, increase this out right here and increase this in shape just like this. I can go around and change around, let's say for example, uh, the type of the font as well. And I can select this and increase this in size as well. So I'm just going to increase this and that's it. So just like that, I have the font. Then I can go to animation right here and here are different types of options. Like let's say for example, there's the wavy style right here. I can go around and cl click on this, double click on this to apply it out. And that is how it seems. If I were to click on the play button, you can see that the wavy style is applied. And you can see that this is the cursor. You can click and drag this around. This is the starting and this is the ending portion. You can go and change this around as well. Let's say for example, if I were to go around and click and drag the point right here, then I can change around the length of the animation as well. So I, if I really want it quick, I can just drag it out over here. And then I can press the space bar and you can see that it is much more faster. I can also double click and apply other options. Let's say for example, if I were to press space, you can see that that is how it looks. Press space again and that is how it looks. If I were to double click on this, you can see that you have this option as well. So just like that, you can go around and change all the options. You can go around, select this one, this one, and this one, and change the length of the text as well, just like that. So I'm just going to go around right here. And let's say I want to select out uh, the cinema style right here. So this is there. So I'm just going to go around on the front and press the play button. So I want the other text animation as well. So I'm just going to click on the plus button, drag it down right here. And then I'm going to say, keep on learning right here. So I'm just going to say, keep on learning right here. And then I'm going to select all by pressing control A and I'm going to decrease the font size right here. And once I do that, let's say I want this to appear a bit later so I can simply resize this, move it right here. And then I can go around and let's say I'm, I want uh, a different type of uh, the text animation. So let's say I want uh, this one right here. So once I double click this, you can see that that has been applied and I can resize this and there you go. There's the animation of the text right there and then it disappears and there you go. That's the animation of the text I have. Let me just go around and apply another one right here. Let's say for example, I want to apply for this kind of an animation right here. So I can go around onto the beginning right here and then there you go. You got the animation right here, but for this you do not have the timeline, but that's okay right there. For some you have timeline options right here to change around the length, for some you don't. So I'm just going to go around and press okay and there you go. So you have this one, so I can just go around and you can see that this is the same text. So as you go on to the advanced area, it acts as a single layer right here that you can edit and you can control that out right here, just like that. So let me just go around and increase the size of this right here. And if I were to go on to the beginning, just like this and uh, reduce the size, just like that, you can see that this is how it looks. And you can see that it looks wonderful, just like that. And that is how you can work around with the animation options inside of the advanced text edit uh, options inside of Filmora.